<laughs> He's trying to eat it. <laughs> All right, we just had breakfast at one of the local restaurant marinas here in Green Turtle Key. We had coconut bread French toast. Really, really good. But we have some bad news. <laughs> we got to use the internet to check the weather, the long-term wind forecast for the first time since we left. And it doesn't look very good. We have one day left of good weather and then a week filled with lots and lots of wind and we have to be back on one of those days of lots of wind. We're gonna try to go back just a few days before we had to be back and just kind of based on the weather then, but we weren't expecting a whole week of east wind this late in May. So we're gonna have to cruise pretty much straight through all the way back to West End, all the way back home before it gets too nasty. So like 48 hours of straight going. Yep. And we'll stop along the way so Jetty can use the bathroom on land because she will not go on the boat. And we're going to leave here at Green Turtle Key today. We're going to make a quick stop at Great Sail Key for a few hours. And then we'll head right on to West End, just stop for an hour, and then cross as long as it's relatively calm, safe. But before we do that, we're going on our adventure that we talked about yesterday, which should we tell them? All right, we're not gonna tell you yet, but you'll see. Here we go. They want your food. Piggy. She wants to go so bad. Stay. Hey, no. Stay. They're, they're gonna bite your oh they don't want broccoli. Jetty's over here crying because she wants to play with the pigs, but Pigs supposedly don't like dogs and they bite and stuff, so we don't want to let her off the boat. <laughs> you gotta stay, Jess. Stay. Stay. These are the swimming pigs in the Avaco Island. I don't know, there might there might be more, but these are some we found next to Green Turtle Key. And we saw more swimming pigs in the Exumas last year, and they're just like them, except there's a lot more piglets here. The ones in the Exumas were a lot bigger, and there are only a few piglets here and there. Hey, what's up? Oh. You want one? Open your mouth. <laughs> Ow, <laughs> that hurt. Ready, set, throw it in. How do you feed them without them biting you? Look at all the babies. Look at all these guys. Hey, piggies. Out of here. These guys keep following me around. Hey! Oh my god, look at all those babies. They're everywhere. Can I pet you? Come here.
They're trying to eat the GoPro handle. Oh or drink out of it. I don't know what they're trying to do. <laughs> He's trying to eat it. <laughs> I, I don't have any food for you. <laughs> That's not food. Uh oh. <laughs> See? Just filling up, fueling up here at Green Turtle Key. So we took 73 and a half gallons, and that's total fuel that we used all the way from Jupiter down to Boca, across, and all the way to Green Turtle. About 73 and a half gallons. The fuel here it costs four dollars and thirty-four cents a gallon if you're paying cash, and they charge like three or five percent if you're using credit cards. We just paid all cash. Not too bad for the Bahamas price. We're on our way out of here. We're heading to Great Sail Key. Super bummed. But we had a great trip. It's not over yet. But we're gonna, I was just texting our friend Scott and Erica from Boat Fam, if you guys remember Boat Fam. And we're supposed to meet up with them. We were only like 25 miles away, but we just, we had to leave when, as soon as we could. Otherwise we wouldn't make our weather window to cross back to Florida to get home in time. There's a bunch of big squalls coming through. Nice over here. Squall over here. just starting to go down. Give me another beautiful sunset. Winds lighten up. No storms. Storms have passed. So we're how far are we from Great Sail? Ten miles. We're about ten miles from Great Sail, which is we're probably not even gonna stop the boat. Probably just I'll take Jetty on the tender and I'll take her over the beach and we'll bring her for a walk and everything and we'll probably just keep going all through the night all the way to West End and then hopefully right around we the time we get to West End it's gonna start to get light and then we're gonna start crossing oh we're gonna let Jetty go to the bathroom at West End as well we'll take her for a long walk there right when we get there right before we start crossing so we're gonna end up this vlog here and we'll keep you guys updated through the night and that'll be on the next vlog wish us luck Thank you.